successful and improving you are. Because guess what? What? You just got maybe a big fight announced. Really? Yeah, UFC 292 in Boston. What? Headlining. Yeah, I saw that. I wasn't sure because the UFC called me and said, hey, we're about to announce uh, announce this. Just to give you a little warning, a little heads up. And we're now, Dana's going live soon. I said, all right, bet. I didn't know what else they were going to announce. I thought, oh, they might announce Jamal Hill versus Yuri because yeah, that was kind of me on talks. But no, Big Daddy's the main event um, against Algebra Sterling, August 19th. Boston, Massachusetts. Can you call him Alja Comain anymore? <sighs> nope, can't call him Alja Comain. He's yeah. back-to-back headlining shows. Good for him. Good for him. So uh, uh, what are your thoughts on it, initial reaction? I mean, this is awesome, man. Congratulations. Yeah, you, You've like, been talking about this for years, and it still, just comes I mean, to fruition. It still feels kind of real. I mean, it feels real, but it just still seems so far out. Yeah. That uh, I think once, you know, once it, once it gets a little closer, maybe think once the... Because there's still big fights coming. You know, once it's like the next big fight, yeah. Because which is weird. I feel like they announced it super far out. Yeah. Dana was just too excited. First of all, Aljo called Dana Daddy Dana, which is really weird. Yeah. He said, what are you going to ask Daddy Dana to fight in August? I'm like, first of all, I've never called him Daddy Dana, so I don't know where you got that term from. Daddy Dana. I don't know if that's what you have on your phone. I don't know. I call him Uncle Dana. To call another grown man Daddy like, he's straight up, those were out of his mouth. I've never called him Daddy Dana. Al Jermaine calls Dana Daddy Dana. I'm not, I'm, you know, it's weird, but hey, everyone does their own thing. Yeah. But Uncle Dana, what happened to Al Jermaine saying September? What happened to him saying, I got no pull, I got no power, they don't give a fuck, you do what Dana says. I'm like, exactly, that's what I'm saying in August, because that's what Dana said. I'm not trying to make move dates around, I'm just, I'm just obeying Daddy Dana. <laughs> Yeah, which was kind of weird because Alja was on the MMA hour with Hawani like two, three days ago saying, you know, I don't know. I'll, I'm going to come next week. I'll be able oh. to tell if I can uh, fight. And then once the news was released, Ray Longo, Aljo's coach, came out and said he has no, he hasn't heard Aljo say anything about him signing a deal or him saying the fight was on. So, well, I'm was, showing up August 19th, uh, whether Aljo shows up or they put someone else in there. Daddy's there. Daddy's main event in headlining for the belt, regardless whether it's him or not. And 